to just do up my hair a little bit because I'm gonna be taking this hair out really so well we'll see got a really cute style planned up next but I hope you do enjoy this vlog I hope you all have enjoyed my travel vlogs I am so grateful like I am standing here beaming because it is actually four years since I've been a content creator <laughs> like I cannot believe this four whole years it feels like if it's been way longer because we've been through a lot okay a pandemic just um, being bored with content like so much but if you're still here watching I am so grateful thank you so 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 much thank you so much to all of you who always like like share comment support I really do like I love interacting with y'all all right so let's go to work because we're not that early but yeah let's go hi guys okay guys so for the past week we have been practicing rehearsals for march pass right my entire family is marching and yeah that is why i just i am looking like this most times i go looking pretty crazy but this day after work i just decided you know just look a little bit cute so i'm just throwing on some clothes gotta get me some water and stay hydrated but yeah you will see that coming up in the next vlog so my manager actually celebrated with us she is like seven years as the manager so that was very nice that she threw us a breakfast later in the night time we actually went to rafina's in arima it's one of our favorite spots because after matching all week long we needed something good to eat and listen i am not a doubles person but rafina rafina's has totally converted me i love it okay so now it is saturday i really did not do much this day i am just putting on my moisturizer from good molecules i don't know if y'all remember but they sent me a pr box and i'm super happy because i love their products i had one negative experience with one that kind of burned me a little but i love every other product they sent me the toner for discoloration the serums and the moisturizer but y'all you know i know the skin is skinning because look at this do you see this face right now it is eating okay the face has devoured you right now look at that and i tried something new with my hair just to like do i kind of flip up with a like a claw clip side part kind of vibe and i really loved how it turned out i'm really impressed because we are actually going out so it's my friend's birthday shout out to tia today's her birthday happy birthday tea love ya we're going to nube nueve this new spot that opened up in val park shopping plaza so it's basically us from the trip because we kind of formed this little cute bond and i'm so happy because like i love that kind of vibe people who like travel and have like common interests that is just i love it so here's everybody my cousin kian my sister t the birthday girl her friend shanada me and talia <laughs> cute talia right so no way no way i have to say i'm very much impressed i honestly cannot wait to go back i really like it you have to press this button here that red button which is going to signal the waiter i love that this dress sorry this drink was called a golden sunset it was absolutely sweet and delicious i had me a simple little chicken sandwich and fries but we're mainly here to celebrate our girl tea she is so fun to be around she's kind of like my little sister i love it so they actually offered us some shots we love it we had a round of shots on our own and then they offered us some free shots just because they didn't get to do it like with the light and everything i thought that was really nice the customer service here y'all is great also the food is amazing okay amazing and then it is all of us are taking like videos and cute pictures and stuff because we're having like such a great time and everybody was supposed to dress in brown but y'all i really hardly have brown but seeing all these girls looking so good in brown i'm like girl you need to get you some brown so i had this green dress here with some brown in it but everybody looks so pretty like i love to see girls just outside and doing their thing Woo! okay guys dinner was nice 
We really loved it. Check out the fit. I think my hair kind of fell a little bit. It was like more pinned up on this side. On that side. But say what? Still feel cute. This is the bathroom. This is probably one downside of this place. Like, ugh, you only need a bathroom. Upstairs, but it's okay. Okay, we're off to church. Hey guys, what's up? Back home from church and I'm having me some lunch. Just relaxing. Alright. Who else eats food in a room? Lying around the bed. Me. But yeah. I am um, one of my friends with the She's, it's gonna be sorry <laughs> my mind she's going to be celebrating her birthday on this tuesday of this week so stay tuned for my weekly vlog i'll show you what we do but today she's actually having a photo shoot in the botanical gardens with all of her friends so she had printed jerseys made for us she's actually a friend of my sister's my cousin everything like that so we're all gonna be going to this photo shoot um, so that's why I didn't wear any makeup this morning. And you all know me, I'm on that skin breathing vibe because, I don't know, I just love the skin that I'm in. And it took, it took years for me to get here. Like, for me to just be cool and comfortable with even blemishes or whatever and just be cool, you know? I always hear people make very stupid statements about, like some people will tell me, um, you don't need makeup. That's something that irks my soul. Let me tell you why. Nobody needs makeup. Is makeup oxygen? Is makeup food? Is makeup life? No, that is just so stupid. People do not wear makeup because they need it. At no point do you need it, no matter what your skin looks like. And I know for people who are acne prone, um, psoriasis, scarring, whatever it is, you know, blemishes, imperfections, you're probably gonna be like, oh my God, I need it. And trust me for a while, I thought that if like I let my skin be out there and be seen like <gasps> I'd be so judged or whatever but honestly nobody <laughs> is really thinking like that and you don't need it you, you honestly have to just get to a point of confidence we are just in love with the person that you are no matter what you know and I know that is a whole lot easier said than done trust me I went through years of not liking when I say my skin, I didn't have a problem with the rest of my body, but my face especially. I always used to get like scarring and it took a while, but don't let nobody tell you any crap like, oh my God, you know, you don't need makeup. People always tell me, oh, you look so much more beautiful without makeup. Of course I do. That's my natural face, my natural skin. You will look more beautiful without makeup, no matter what your skin looks like. However, if you like it, wear it. There's nothing wrong with that. People need to stop trying to enforce their entire opinions based on what they think, what they feel for themselves and other people. What is that about? That is so weird if you ask me. Like when somebody tells me, oh, you look so much better without makeup or... No, that is not a problem. When it is, they say, um, you don't need makeup. I'm just looking at you like, okay. Like what? Nobody needs makeup. Good Lord. But... When I'm ready to put it on, I'm going to put it on. I'm a slay, okay? <laughs> and I don't care what anybody thinks of it. Please, do what you love. Do what makes you happy. Makeup, no makeup. Like, everyone is not the same. People just have to learn to accept that and just be cool with other people's choices. Especially when they do not affect you in any way. Food for thought. But yeah, I'm going to eat this food right now and um probably just relax for a little bit i've already edited thank you jesus two of my tiktoks i posted one last night so if it is you're looking at this and you have not checked out my tiktoks my travel tiktoks what are you waiting for right and i have another one already locked and loaded in my drafts to post two nights my nails still look good <laughs> and um then after that we have this is crunch time. It's going to be rehearsals for sports day, which is on Friday, Good Friday, right? So I will be vlogging throughout the week. I didn't really vlog this week. 
but I'll be vlogging throughout the week so you all can see the vibe and everything that we're doing. Um, yeah, so that's after the photo shoot. So we will be like fully decked off for the photo shoot to go sweat it off. Or I might just carry like my micellar water or something. I might, I'm not sure. But yeah. But yeah, so far it's been a really good weekend. But y'all, I'm not gonna lie, I was superbly tired. So tired this morning. Like, y'all can see the bags under my eyes right now. Like, Ooh, I'm not a girl who could really hang. I got home like about one ish and I really had an awesome time. Shout out to Tia. I already thanked her. I was like, girl, thank you so much because y'all know I don't go nowhere. That's how you save money. Well, kinda, because <laughs> there's always online shopping. <laughs> but anyway, but yeah, it was a really nice vibe. A really nice vibe. I will definitely go back to that um, spot, Nueve. And I told Naya, and she's like, oh my gosh, I have to go with my friends. I was like, yeah, your friends will really like it. So, yeah. Alright, guys. Bye. Okay, guys. So, this is the makeup look for the photo shoot. I'm really loving, like, a natural beat. This is my idea of natural. If it's not yours, I fully understand. But I just love, like, a lot of blush. Like, I got into the blush game so late. But I love how, like... You know, that whole blush look is just, it's giving tall. Like, I love it. And this is what it looks in the sunlight. Just really, really pretty. I'm so pleased with it. So, now we're heading off to the Botanical Gardens. You, I can't tell you when last I've been to bo the Botanical Gardens. Like, hmm, I'm trying to remember. I think when I was probably a teenager. <laughs> yeah, for like some kind of summer camp. Um, yeah, the, what is it again? So, field trip, right. Like a summer camp field trip. I honestly have not been here in so long but i thought the idea was kind of cool to you know have us dress in like white t-shirts and jeans with a little print on it and i didn't even know that people be coming here and having like picnics and walking their dogs and thing like i probably need to come out a little bit more <laughs> i'm so ashamed to say like i just don't be outside but we're working on it so this is Abilene the birthday girl in pink and this is everyone me we were trying to form an a for her name and this is her um taking some pictures by this flower i really do love how she looks she looks so cute in this pink dress i just think it's such a gorgeous kind of vibe i have known her practically all my life she's so goofy and funny <laughs> but such a nice person so this was a really pretty treat and then we found a squirrel oh my god i was like oh my god i have not seen a squirrel in real life in years so I'm just like, hey, friend, trying to talk to it, but he wasn't happening. It's all right. But yeah, um, Queen's Park Savannah was filled with a lot of people, but I loved how the sky looked. Like, people was in the Savannah just chilling, playing music, having, like, you know, just, like, chill, cool vibes. So this was nice. It was nice just to be out. I have not been out on a weekend in a long while. <laughs> like, period. I'm such a homebody. Like, oh, my God. But so cool. Guys, straight from the photo shoot. Me, to practice <laughs> so yeah i mean the face is still sitting the face is still giving even though i'm feeling a little bit sweaty right now but yeah really yeah because i feel like i want to change because i'm feeling very hot in these jeans but yeah <laughs> don't be a hater okay you feel your bad, you're smelling bad back in the ship when she was just in primary school. Okay, guys, I'm finally back home. I am so tired. My head looks a hot mess right now because I practically sweated it out. But say what? Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. Weekly vlogs are going to be back from this weekend. I think I'll be posting one like on easter sunday so look out for that i'm just so grateful you know we've made it to four years that's crazy four years i'm so happy four years and i love it i have my moments as you all know i'm always honest with you all i have my moments where i honestly don't feel like it and i get demotivated and you know stress and you know you just want to accomplish certain things but i'm proud of myself i'm happy you know so i'm grateful and i could not have done any of this without people who genuinely support me 
so thank you very much all right and i'm gonna see you in my next one bye guys Nigga, come, huh, fans, got me too excited. Yeah.